Okay, so today I'm just going to show you another resource uh, that you can try for reading in French and in English. Um, just to let you know, there's a, a trial you can get for 14 days, a free trial. Um, I'm in day 12, so um, you can set up your own account. So it's reading A to Z, and you'll just go through straightforward to set up an account. Once you're logged in, your page should look like this, and you'll have a couple of options. Um, I start with resources. Because I'm French Immersion, I'm going to go straight to World Languages on the left here. I'm going to pick French leveled books. But as you can see, I can pick just frequency words, flashcards, graphic organizers in French. But I'm going to go French leveled books. So once I'm in, I can either select by grade level here. Okay. Um, so you can see this is like the DRA level 30. So usually for French immersion, I start around P and move my way up. So uh, you can select um, by different areas, like if you just want to have nonfiction books. Okay, so I'm just going to look at nonfiction books in level T. Voila, these are the six books or eight books that I have in French. So I'm going to open up one here. It says nonfiction informal. So I'm going to open up Le Camouflage. I have a few options. Okay, I can either project the book if I were at school on my projector, or I can download it in various forms. So I've been downloading it in this single side um, book. You can also look through the book just to see if you like it. Okay, and it gives you a little description here, how many words, um, what grade level. So I'm gonna click here um, to download the book. And I'm at my limit, so I can no longer download, but there you would have the option to download to your hard drive. Also, which I love here are they have worksheets en français, along with discussion cards en français, and a comprehension quiz in French. So I'll just show you what that looks like once it's opened. I'm just going to drag this over. So I've opened up. So here, for example, would be the kind of comprehension questions you would get, okay, for the chocolate article. And then we have a little worksheet here. Again, we don't have to print all of this stuff. This, you know, maybe the kids can do it orally over, or just, um, or they can print it out, or you could even download this into your Google Docs and the kids could write into it. I could show you how to do that. Okay, and then there's the article here that the kids would read through. Um, and what I like about this is the kids can actually highlight and add notes into that. It does says read aloud, which I'm not. So yeah, the reading out loud, maybe uh, you might want to play around with that option. Um, but there are other options about taking notes and kids being able to highlight onto the, some of these documents. Okay, so that's just a quick lesson. Um, you get about uh, 10 books is what I was able to download with the free account. Okay, merci. Have a nice day. Bye.